I think I could say we found this technically today, even though now it's Saturday for me. So technically I could say yesterday, but Friday, um, because it's been, I, when I was using Twitter more, I spent a lot of time on game dev Twitter and I, and I have not found a suitable replacement for it. And a lot of people have not left game dev Twitter, uh, obviously. But I've been finding a lot more game dev posts on Blue Sky under the, well, game dev tag, and it seems to be flourishing there, which is nice. I mean, I would mention co-host too, because I find some cool stuff on co-host all the time, but co-host is also dying, you know? Oh, I should drink some water. My throat feels like, just kind of fuzzy. Um, I'll probably keep in games and demos because I don't think this game has a category. This game is like still in development and definitely not even uh on uh like have a Steam page or whatever. Like I was surprised this game even had a demo. Um, because I was seeing some stuff the developer was playing with or like showing off on their Blue Sky account, and I was like, oh cool. And I was looking over it and it's like, oh. This this is for a game that uh, you have a build for. It's like, oh, it's exciting. And it's like, turn-based RPG? Furries? Let's go. In the world of Gaia, a realm on the verge of a magical industrial revolution. Oh, boy. A national a nation known as the Empire wages a long and brutal war campaign against its adversary to the north, the Republic. Its leader, King Rowan, seeks a way to bring an end to the war and claim victory for the Empire. In the remote village of Ashvale, a young fox boy named Lei finds his home in flames, attacked by a man bearing the sigil of the Empire he lives under. On the run, he meets and befriends Pierce, a stoic wanderer from the Republic, and Maya, a, a cheerful yet mysterious magician, and learns about his destiny as the last remaining Celestial, those who are descended from both the mortal uh, Gaians and the ancient Divines. The ragtag group set off on a quest to help Lei gather his powers as a celestial and confront the king who relentlessly pursues him. Along the way, they will learn to overcome each of their inner struggles, uncover the truth behind the king's plans, and will reveal secrets that could change their lives forever. Features an auto time battle system featuring a unique action point mechanic strategically manage when to conserve ap and when to spend it on powerful attacks and combat system that feels right home in the 90s Ooh, bravely default rumblings experience a heartfelt story of a young boy coming to terms with the complexities of the world and his own self-doubt with a few shocking twists meet a colorful and diverse cast of furry characters and inhabit the world Furry, 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 furry. In development, Crit Chance Studios. Made an RPG maker. JRPG, about an hour. Ah, there's a Patreon, there's a Twitter. I don't know what the community thingy is. It might be, a, like, Discord, maybe. It looks like it takes gamepad. We've already downloaded it. It sounds just like Final Fantasy IV. Whoa! It sounds like I, I would say it sounds Final Fantasy esque, but Final Fantasy IV specifically starts you off as being a villain, and it's just like I don't know. Maybe that's just the one the one stroke about it that I always think about. But like the consequences for you being a vil a villain at the beginning. They could have they could have permeated more. I mean, Cecil does feel pretty guilty, though. Honestly, the whole thing about uh, like you know, being chosen one and stuff like that, and you know, well, ragtag group of characters. That's pretty much any JRPG, right? Or any JRPG worth its salt. Uh, last play a second ago. Did it not launch? Is Final Fantasy IV a coming of age story? I mean, I guess it is. 
you can have a coming of age as an adult. Can I just run the ETC? Switch to another version? Okay. Oh boy. Sits, not four. Oh, sorry, I can't read. <laughs> Is Sits the one with the mechs in it? I should get going and make progress on my own gaming adventure. Wait, were you giving me my un were you giving me your undivided attention? Were you not gaming at the same time? <laughs> uh, have great adventures. <laughs> Hydrate before you dehydrate. I guess while I'm updating, I'll look at some development logs. There's a brood queen. That's all I needed to know. Shit, that's all you had to say. Okay, I got I got a version running. Oh no, you're gonna make me cry, bro. And it does work with gamepad. Nothing super TV noise? Yup. Yeah. Screen curve. You shitting me? You're not shitting me. I might shit myself before you shit me. God, can you hear that fucking t <gasps> <clears throat> The story so far. Fleeing from the burning remains of his home village, Lay arrives in Galaport, a bustling hub of airships and merchants. There, he is confronted by a town guards and discovers that he has a bounty on his head. He is rescued by Pierce, a wanderer from the Republic. Lay convinces Pierce to let him tag along, they speak to Ava, who reveals that the town has recently been plagued by giant insect monsters and that all air traffic has been halted. In exchange for safe transport, Pearson and Leigh agree to head into the, adorn the abandoned sewers underneath town and investigate. Hey, watch your footing. Don't think anything down here has been a... Seen a toolbox in years. Uh, oh! Crap, look out! Whoa! You alright? Yeah! At least the water broke my fall. I think I bruised my tail a little low. What's the awful smell? The 
It's an old sewer line, after all. Even brand new, it wouldn't exactly smell like roses. Ew! <laughs> All the clothes stink now! It's gonna give me a headache! How can you stand it? That's pretty bad, don't get me wrong, but I guess your nose is a lot more sensitive than mine is. Anyway, the sooner we wrap things up, the sooner we can get out of here. In the meantime, I don't know. I'm trying to breathe too much? I, I guess. Let's hurry. Okay, three party members met. Um, Lei probably uses more spells because has more MP. Uh, they're both at the same level, but Pierce has more health and we're reason to believe that Pierce is more experienced. What skills? Focus. Increase critical hit chance for three turns. Okay. No magic. And Ember. Oh, wow. Deals fire damage. Reveal information about opponent. Scan. And shakedown. Oh, and you steal? Oh, fuck yes. Or LP. That's interesting. LP isn't the same thing as HP, though, so... Let's see. Next level, 50. Weapon Daggers. Armor Bandana. Accessory Lucky Stone. Charm Parite uh, tr Trinket. We got Attack Defense. Matt. Matt. Uh, okay, Attack Defense. I don't know what MAT is. But I'm pretty sure MDF is like Magic Defense. Oh, MAT! It's Magic Attack, dummy! Attack, defense, magic attack, magic defense, agility, luck. Ugh. Even with three letter abbreviations, my dyslexia is kicking my ass. Oh, you got a training sword! That's so cute. Training sword, coarse tunic, and guard ring. Okay, so you're actually Titus, I guess. I think Pierce is an owl? A uh, pair of short blades used in close combat. The cloth, uh, cloth headband protecting the forehead. Increases luck. Grants the ember spell. I figured we could do a trade. Durable clothing that can withstand rough travels. A basic sword used for combat training. I'm already doing my own thing. Also, I really love the texture of the the screen. Um, I feel like I can touch it. It feels like like soft construction paper. Party restore. Save. I'm gonna go with Unlucky 13. The flowing symbol nests you as a save point. Interact with the save point to recover HP and MP, as well as save your game. It's a good idea to save your game often. Alright, seems like a puzzle. to check if you were joking or you were being serious about the used diaper. I was like, oh, that'd be funny. Ah! The burns! Jeez, kid. I wasn't 
obvious? I wasn't thinking. I thought, I don't know. If you knew, why didn't you stop me? What do I look like, your mother? Figured you had enough sense not to try and walk through boiling hot vapor. Don't say that. What? What's with that face? It's nothing. Forget it. Anyways, how do we get past? Gotta be maintenance controls, right? Let's take a look around. So, does this game not have random battles then? It's locked. Ah! Well, I guess that's my answer. Oh my gosh! I love the sprite work. Fire muck emerged. Alright, Lei. Stay on your guard. Want my advice, or do you think you can handle it? I got this! Yeah! Just like with those guards, right? I can do it! <laughs> Good attitude. Show them what you got. <laughs> oh, two attacks because two handed. Nice. of muck. Don't know why that would be useful, but okay. Found a rusty key. Wait, why would I do that? look a lot like materia uh materia slots party restored 
Alright, so at least I got some, uh, some potions in the tank. Unlock with key! The key broke. Whoa! What are those things? Guess we found the nut Sable was talking about. You mean, they were all monster eggs? Think so. Let's not disturb them if we can help it. Pierce's past. Hey Pierce, I've been wondering... Earlier, you say you were just a wanderer passing through? Your plan. Well, how do you decide where to go next? I mean, what made you come to Gilport? <sighs> Came to look for someone. Really? Who are you looking for? If it's okay to ask, I mean. Just a guy I used to know, I guess. Was he a friend of yours? What's his name? What's the hell with all these questions? You want my life story or what? Hey, I was just asking. Did I say something wrong? Whatever. Don't worry about it. Anyway, came to Gale Porter following a lead. Didn't pan out though, so time to look elsewhere. Oh. You think you're ever gonna find him? I don't know. You know, my grand always told me if I just set my mind to it, I could do anything. And she, uh... She was really wise, you know? I'm sure you'll find him. Is that right? Appreciate the optimism, kid. Wish I could share it. to heal me, it will use to heal me, yes it is, yes it is. Accessory slot. Oh, you can gain new accessory slots on level ups. Accessories must be really important, considering accessories can give you uh, spells. Keen Eye learned. Also, a new accessory slot. Good job, Pierce. All right, that's will burn me. Oh wait, that's a. Uh, I can walk here. Hi, right trinket. Hey, Lei, you know what this is? Um, jewelry? Huh, <laughs> almost. It's a charm. Uh, I think Gran told me about those. It's got a piece of linen right in it, and it lets you cast magic, right? That's right. Here, you should try it on. Whoa, really? Can I? Whoa, it looks so cool. As the character levels up, they may gain new charm slots. Be sure to equip the new charms to allow the character to cast more spells at once. Oh, accessory slots are different than charm slots. I'm gonna do one, one with both of these, because I want to see if, for some reason, if there's any use in that. Because I'm stupid. But also, I like to explain that. 
Canine. Marks the target, allowing any ally to deal a guaranteed critical strike. Ooh, I like that. That's some good support shit. I like, I like. You never know what people flush down the toilet. That's why they're evil. <laughs> oh yeah. We've had to clean some uh, public bathrooms in our day. Inside. A living pile of muck and grime. It uses its sticky slime to trap foes. Resist physical. Weak to none. Drops a bottle of muck, steal item potion. sewer has a monster in it, like a gator or a snake. Uh, I guess my house is a sewer then, because it has a gator and a snake in it. <laughs> oh, that's awkward. try that door. I just assumed it wouldn't open. Yep, it's locked. I guess I should disturb those uh, eggs. I wonder if focus will affect me. Yeah. 
the key. Oh, fuck. Ah, it's just one. Smart nothing. the key just like my heart there's no other way to go what do we do <sighs> I think we might just have to slash our way through this what but didn't you say we shouldn't disturb them well yeah but don't really see in another way forward do you I, I guess not right then there goes nothing yikes they come. Sting scythes emerged. So these are the bugs attacking the airships. Whoa! That looked really scary. Stay focused! Just look for a weakness and hit them as hard as you can. Sometimes enemies can become daunting during this state. The enemy resists all types of damage, but can be staggered to make them vulnerable. While daunting, uh, another gauge will show underneath this HP. This is the stagger gauge and shows you how close an enemy is to being staggered. A staggered enemy will be temporarily incapacitated, leaving them open to attack, as well as rendering them weak to all damage types. Any damage will eventually stagger an enemy, but any enemy's weakness will make them fall even faster. Watch out, sometimes an opponent becoming daunting when preparing to unleash a powerful attack. Staggering such a foe will interrupt the attack, when you're up against a daunting opponent, exploit your enemy's weakness to stagger them quickly. Then dish out the damage while they're vulnerable. Sewers tend to be shit levels to play in. Yeah, I've heard that too. Shit, I did not mean to do shakedown. Venomous Flying Insect. Uh, aggressively defends the queen of the hive. Weak to fire. Resists none. Drop items, but carapace. Steal items, potion, and ether.
honorable. Stay on target. You got it. I guess I got lucky in the fact that I can still stagger it. It's just gonna be take a lot fucking longer. But I did just grab an ether. Which is pretty clutch. From me to you. <laughs> Gee, thanks. Because this fight is hard, or harder rather, um, that's why this enemy is made to even drop. Damn! Yeah, that's why I think the enemy is is also made to even have that ether drop. I was like, well, you can just steal an ether and throw it on. It'll be fine. There's just two of them. Yeah. I guess I get why the airships were grounded. I can't imagine fighting a whole swarm of those things. Huh? What's wrong? It's nothing. Let's keep moving. Well... Yeah. Well, I can't get through there at all. Like I figured. Comet salt. Revive a fallen ally and restore some HP. A bottle filled with slime of the mermuck, used for crafting. A hard shell of an insect, used for crafting. Potions do 300 points? That's pretty nice. Okay, you don't need two of these. I have no indication that you ever needed two of these. That fight would have been over much quicker. are actually opens. Something bugging you? There's so many eggs around here. There's a lot of bug monsters getting ready to hatch, huh? Does that mean there's an even bigger one that's laid all these eggs? <sighs> hey, what's wrong? Don't worry about it. Hey, Pierce, uh, are you scared of all the bugs? Don't be ridiculous! I'm right, aren't I? You hate bugs! Whatever! Just drop it, alright? Oh, oh, I didn't mean to upset you. I'm sorry. 
Never mind. Let's we'll just get this over with. Guess it could have been worse, anyway. Could have been down here alone. Bet you're glad you got you let me tag along, huh? Hey. Pushing it a little, aren't you? That is a salty comment. Probably got online and saw negative comments. Wow, found a rusty key immediately. Swing learned and got a new charm slot. Good job, Lee. And new charm slot for Pierce. So I haven't found any more, any different spells other than Ember. It is funny to find Ember in the sewers. Oh shit. Wild swing! Hey, you guys want to see the game over screen? I don't. Oh my god, still killed it in one though. <laughs> rats are occurring. I don't see any rats here. I see bugs and goop. Whoa! I guess they're just a regular fucking enemy now. Fuck my life. Party restored. Sure that come, that'll come in handy soon. Since I haven't gotten a poison status, and I am in the sewers, which is the perfect place to introduce a poison status. Synergy. 
Ah! I was really hoping I was do the. Uh, I was doing another one hit KO because that'd be. Because I, I also feel like it's a uh, like Ludo narratively resonant to do it this way, where it's like this person who is much more skilled at fighting uh, and combat and this like defending yourself life like pinpointing the weak spots of this uh, young upstart who I swear has a costume that's reminding me of a just lightly of a I can't put my finger on it don't jinx yourself I'm very tired but the potion shot must be completed Oh, don't uh, jinx yourself with the. Do you want to see the the ending, the game over screen? I have a good sense of humor. It's awesome. And you know, it's nice cheating death. <laughs> Did not die. These ones are just squishier and weak to fire. That sure crit didn't do much. Oh shit, I didn't even need to cast fire. Looks like it. <laughs> but fuck it. Sorry, I didn't mean to be such a child. That time at least. Oh, Ether! I guess I'm getting to a boss. Yeah, boss battle. Boss battle. Oh, yeah. What's that? It's like it came right out of the ground. They built their nest around it. Did this thing attract the monsters? It's so shiny. Fucking autism moments. It's so shiny, I wanna touch it, even though it has a bunch of bug slime on it. What was that? That can't be good. Oh. Yikes! It's a heartless! I mean, it's huge! Think we found the queen? Here it comes. Brood queen emerged. Let's brood, bitch. I'm I'm playing an older build, so she's a little more brooding. Boss battle. <laughs> I'm playing a uh, Fox Hill Fable. Uh, it's a game and demo. Welcome, Raiders. Hope your pants are dry if you want them to be dry. But why would we want them to be dry? It's Saturday morning.
No worries. The game has a boss boy, so I'm hooked. Oh my god! Wait, what the fuck? Of course it called the cavalry. Th there's so many! What do we do? Just gotta stay focused. Oh, now we're poisoned. Wait, she consumes them, gaining power? It, it ate its minion? Got a really bad feeling about this. Tried to counterattack for scanning? Wow. Uh, Queen of the Bugs uses thick webs to protect its eggs. Weak to fire. Resist nothing. Drop items, none. Steal items, antidote. system is scary. 12? Uh... Oh, what were you playing, Lee? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, I'm dying! It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. We'll get through this. Focus and go all out. Oh, God. I guess she hurt me. Wild swing. Excellent hit. Oh, my God. She has so much health, huh? Yeah, I guess she is tanky. Beefing up on potions. We did Final Fantasy 15? Sorry, I can't read Roman numerals all that well sometimes. 15, right? The one that just came to PC that was on PS, uh, PS5 before? Fantasy 14, got it. 
I wasp. Not expecting that. Die in one hit, please. Uh, two is fine. I don't think we'll have enough MP. I guess we can always try. Yeah, no, it'll take too long, especially since I have to recover. Alright, I should introduce myself to people who don't know me, but if, but if you uh, frequently stream, you might have heard of uh, me. I'm Fluffbite, uh, I'm Scribblebite specifically of the Fluffbite Entertainment System. Uh, we're plural streamers, uh, we share a body, uh, we're baby furs, we're also uh, like disabled and uh, trans, and we like talking about that stuff, and you know, we try to be there for people, but we also are, like, really, <laughs> uh, really interesting in a weird sort of way. We're, we think we, we think we do it pretty well. We like being silly, but we also like being philosophical sometimes. weird to describe myself and, and try to compliment me and my entire system. It just feels weird. Hell yeah! Beefy, beefy queen. <laughs> now let's see who broods who. God, I blame Hollow Knight for making butt for making bug furries hot. <laughs> Mating presses the brood queen. <laughs> oh, and thank you. Also, um. If you gotta head out because it's like late and stuff, uh, feel free. Uh, bedtimes are important, even on weekends, if if you have things to do. Apparently, I do not, because we're probably gonna be streaming for another couple of hours. <laughs> Leia's now level four. Pierce is also now level four. <sighs> we did it! Holy crap! We did it! Sheesh. I'm glad that's over with. Nice work, kid. What's happening? Now what? Black Princess? Where am I? Is this Gaia? Huh? Who are you? Hey, wait! Lay, are you okay? Uh, I think so. What was that? There was a bright light and then you passed out. You sure you feel alright? Um, uh, I think so, yeah. That was weird. I passed out? Was that a dream just now? Well, that's a relief. Anyway, without the queen, the colony down here should disperse soon enough. Let's see if we can find an exit. Not keen on seeing what other weird crap is looking down here. You said it. Let's get out of here. <sighs> okay, now that I have a free moment, uh, I should, uh... I, I need to make sure Leaf gets proper due. Uh... Uh, 
I don't think I've done a shout out myself in a long time. I think that's how you do it. Nope, I am Scribble. You can tell because I have, uh... I have corruption on my body. <laughs> but it's easy to mistake us. Nay nay! Pretty sure I did the shout out wrong. If I have a, if I have a mod in chat still, please do the shout out for me. I am I am tired. Oh, this was such a good uh, proof of concept or vertical slice or whatever. Thanks for playing. Oh, a space. Okay. I gotta get used to doing this stuff again. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for telling me how to shout you out. That's so embarrassing. If anyone wants to play Fots, Bl Fots Blade Fable, God, that's a mouthful. Fots Blade Fable, Fots Blade Fable, Fots Blade Fable. Fable, Fable. I, I cannot say it five times fast. I'll drop the URL in chat. It's in development right now. The last, the last uh, updated build was 15 days ago, so, like, the dev is, the dev is, uh, doing, doing really good hard work. Crit Chance Studios. 